Hi, my name is Max with your WCCO at State Fair newscast. We begin today's coverage with news from the haunted house. WCCO anchors Frank and Chris went in this morning, but they haven't come out. Witnesses who saw them enter said they looked ready, any for anything, not scared in the least. That was four hours ago. A search party went in 30 minutes ago. Reporters say that they were they can hear Frank and Chris screaming, but they haven't been able to track them down yet. A mummy from the second floor says he saw the pair about an hour ago. He said they jumped up and screamed, then raced off before he could grab one of them. This is a developing story. We'll keep you updated on the search. Let's check in on weather and traffic. Well, hello, I'm Nana. I'm with your WCCO weather and traffic update. It's a beautiful day at the fair. I'm so glad that we're here. Officials say they're expecting record numbers of people on the streets and maybe in a few other places. We are being, we are beginning to see backups on Justin Avenue by the Miracle Birth Center where Ashley the cow is expected to give birth at any moment. You guys should all get out there. Things are getting congested on Cooper Street right outside the Lumberjack show. We're hearing reports that a family of four waving in and out of traffic. Please be careful. And apparently they heard how delicious the new deep fried green or grilled, excuse me, grilled cheese bites were and just couldn't wait to go and try some. I've had them, they're fantastic. <laughs> As for this beautiful weather, which it is fantastic, it's not hot this year, it's expected to hold right through the week. Come back if you can. See you later. Bye. This just in, WCCO anchors Frank and Chris have been found. Searchers found them in the third floor hiding behind a coffin. They were tired, thirsty, and still a little shaken. After the long ordeal, but they are expected to be okay. I'm Max. And I'm Kathy, and thank you for watching WCCO at the State Fair Newscasts booth. Yeah.